Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm in my bathroom and I'm using my iPhone without a microphone. <laughs> so I feel like I should just put these type of videos out so that you guys can see the things that I'm buying and what I think about them because I'm I've been kind of waiting for everything to kind of be perfect like my lighting I have to get that right and when I can sit down and do that then I can start making videos again you know but I haven't been doing that very well so I want to start putting out videos sort of like this just so that you guys can see some of the things I'm getting and what I think about them and hey if you were looking at them maybe this will help you so today we're talking Trish McAvoy, New York. I bought these sponges. They are called the Sexy Nine Blackberry and Vanilla Musk Body Sponge Duo. And it came in this. So yeah, you can smell it before you purchase it, but you get two of them. But we'll get to that in a second. Uh, it's a richly foaming body sponge infused with the iconic scent of Trisha's Sexy Nine Blackberry and Vanilla Musk. Just to be clear, the vanilla is there, but it does not overpower. Like I'm not a vanilla person. So if you're not a vanilla person, there is a hint of it and it's there, but it's not like Bath and Body Works vanilla lotion or, you know, old school Victoria's Secret vanilla lotion or whatever, <laughs> you know? Um, what is it? It's infused with the again iconic scent of Trisha's sexy nine blackberry and vanilla musk and enriched with skin nourishing vitamin E, shea butter and natural humectants. Trisha's richly foaming body sponge will cleanse, exfoliate, moisturize and soften your skin. It includes two sponges, enjoy at least 20 uses per sponge and it retails for $55. Okay. I've been using this for the last week and this is what it looks like. Okay, does it smell nice? Yes, I like the musk vanilla bit in there. Like it's soft and it's and it does stay in your body for a little bit. It doesn't like you get out of the shower and you no longer smell the scent. No, it's it, it lingers on your body and it's a soft scent. Is it something that you can replace with Oh, I don't have to buy my perfume anymore no but it does linger on your skin like you can smell it when you smell yourself okay I think the idea is great does it exfoliate it is this is how it feels and as you see yes there is soap on it the problem I have with this is you put it on your body and you're scrubbing yourself with it no matter how many times you try and wring it out or whatever which you're just bringing out most of the soap in here that's supposed to last for 20 uses it's still like using a dirty washcloth because as you can see it's not white anymore <laughs> so this is how it came so it it's not self-cleansing it's it gets dirty and it sort of stays dirty a bit, especially if you're someone like me who goes to Disney regularly. And I don't know if how many of you guys been to theme parks, but your feet just get dirty with sand and dirt on it just, and you're like, I'm walking on concrete, but it, you just get dirty. And so even though you rinse off the dirt on your feet or on your legs, you're still washing and the dirt still gets on this and it doesn't quite come off. So I think the exfoliation, what they're going for, yeah, you can feel it on your skin. However, after you wash, I'm not feeling soft. I feel that real cleansed feeling when you touch your skin and it's a, it's not slip or anything of that nature. It's that, um, oh, Oh, I'm I'm really I'm really clean, which is good. But the shea moisture and all that stuff doesn't stay behind for some reason to make you feel soft. Um, do I like the concept? Yes. Do I the and also there's no string on here for it to like 
dry or anything. So you have to put it on something, which isn't good. Would I buy this again? No. Um, and the only reason is because it is just hygienic wise, hygiene wise, it's just not, I would think maybe if I put this on a washcloth or, or something else, then maybe uh, that will work better because this is just, this is just not clean. <laughs> so yeah, that's my biggest problem with it. Um, does it smell good? Yes. Does it exfoliate? I'm sure it does. It just doesn't leave you feeling soft like like when you use an exfoliator normally does. So yeah, I hope that helps you guys. If it was something you were looking at purchasing, uh, I've been using it twice a day for a week and it still suds up a lot for me. So, you know, and I do like the concept, but for me, I just, I don't feel like it's clean. Like, I feel like it's dirty. <laughs> I feel like I've been using the same washcloth for a week, but haven't washed it or, uh, and it feels like it's not exfoliating the way, um, it's not hard enough. So it's a, it seems like it's more of a soft exfoliation, but you don't, you're not soft afterwards. You're more feeling Oh, I'm squeaky clean. That's the word I was looking for. It's the squeaky feel. I'm squeaky clean. So yeah, I hope that helps you guys. I hope you have an amazing day and I will see you next time. Bye. Yeah, guys, it's, yeah, I think I, I, just a body wash would be fine. Um, the smell is good though. It's a nice smell. It's not overpowering and yeah. It's just dirty <laughs> and maybe i'm doing something wrong maybe it's user error so if i'm doing something wrong you guys can correct me in the comments and tell me to get my act together but yeah the dirt from my feet and stuff that goes on here after i rinse it off from you know disney or walking outside and i wash my feet and stuff it just it just doesn't come off so yeah maybe it's user error for me though and you guys can help me get my act together. <laughs> All right, bye. <laughs> yeah, I, I won't repurchase it.